so my mum emailed me the other day and she was like, oh my God, I found this amazing sheet of coincidences between JFK and Abraham Lincoln. Look at them, it's unbelievable. And I opened it up and it says, have a history teacher explain this if they can. Well, I like a challenge. I'm not a history teacher, but you know, I've got a degree in it. I think I've got some qualification to prove this wrong. So uh, here we go. Um, Abraham Lincoln was elected to Congress in 1846, and that's correct. And it says JFK was elected to Congress in 1946. Um, in 1946. The thing is, and as you could tell from my slip of my tongue, he was elected in 1947. But hey, I'm I'm not going to worry too much about that but that's sort of an inconsistency in the first two lines next one lincoln was elected as president in 1860 kennedy was elected as president in 1960 that's correct they both were particularly concerned with civil rights that's correct next one both wives lost a child while living in the white house well frankly that's quite a personal thing and doubt is going not going to be documented that well um so i'm just going to say that's a possible yes or no, but we're going to call that a lie. Um, both presidents were shot on a Friday. Yeah, we can check out the dates. That's fine. So that could be the case. Um, both presidents were shot in the head. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Lincoln's secretary was named Kennedy. Well, is this his personal secretary? Because if it's secretary of state, that's incorrect. So... They don't list the name of his personal secretary, so don't know. Both were assassinated by Southerners. True. Both were succeeded by Southerners named Johnson. True. Uh, both assassins were known by their free names. Well, you know, that's something the media decides, not us. So, uh, yeah, you could call him Lee Oswald if you want, or uh, John Booth. Let's see how it goes. Both names are composed of 15 letters. Wow, another coincidence, you know, crazy. So scary, these. Both the assassins were assassinated before their trials. Yep, true. Now, this is the kicker. And all, like, whoever created this just needed to Google it. This is so, so stupid. A week before Lincoln was shot, he was in Monroe, Maryland. Now, I can't check that. I don't know. Like, I'm sure if I go to the archives, find some records, you know, you'll get some clarification of his movements. That's fine. A week before Kennedy was shot, he was with Marilyn Monroe. Wow. There's only one way this could actually happen, and that is if uh, Kennedy was visiting her grave. Because Marilyn Monroe died in 1962. So... When stuff like this comes through, don't believe everything you read. For the sake of history, anyone can buy a website or create something for very cheap and it can be a load of rubbish sometimes. Anyway, I informed my mum of this and she was like, oh, spoil the fun. So if I've spoiled the fun for you, sorry. <laughs>